all right guys so <clears throat> this is a quick uh, video uh, just a follow up of my previous video uh, regarding hosting agreement and a research associate position where the candidate was not uh, given the hosting agreement or work permit <clears throat> so i got a confirmation from him that yes it was the fact that the university was searching someone who already have work permit uh, in Ireland so that's what he confirmed me so now at this um, so I, I thought of saying um, give you this a little suggestion it is completely my personal uh, suggestion and uh, you can follow or uh, may not follow so here is the fact so in Ireland if and this is only for researcher okay uh, so if you get some research contract of Two years then this is what happens so at the at the 21st month of your contract you can go to your immigration office uh, and you can get the permanent residency of Ireland which is called STEM 4 so for that you have to have a two years 24 months contract of your research okay now and then even after the finishing of your two years contract of the job of that research uh, with the university or whatever it is, then you can stay legally in Ireland because at the 21st month, you got the permanent residency a sort of something called STEM4 visa in Ireland, though it's uh, you have to renew in every two years. But uh, during the re renewal, you probably <clears throat> will be not asked uh, for any sort of specific sort of contract or anything so my point is that if you get a two years contract then you get the stamp four which is the kind of permanent residency in ireland so you do not need to search for you do not need any work permit after that after getting that stamp four so you can start your business also you can um I, I mean, you can uh, you can uh, you can apply to other kind of jobs if you do not uh, intend to do further research and so on. So, so uh, but now if you get a research contract which is less than sort of twenty four months, for example, let's say nine months or eighteen months or twelve months, then at near the finish near the finishing of that contract that is nine months say 12 months or 18 months unless you get another contract or your existing contract extended then you actually uh, cannot stay in ireland unless you have another contract or your contract is extended legally because uh, because uh, with the nine months or 12 months or 18 months contract uh, you do not get the pr uh, the stamp four right so this is why i i will suggest if you are coming uh, if you get a uh, if you get a research contract then kind of this is my personal opinion as i told before that try to get a two years contract so that you get the permanent residency uh, in Ireland and then continue your staying. So this is also a fact that uh, for the people who actually wants to stay for longer in Ireland. Otherwise, if somebody just wants to do a research during their academic career in Ireland and then they finish this contract and go to some other country or other kind of uh, things, then this is not uh, sort of um, this, this advice or this suggestion is not sort of applicable to those people. But this is only uh, kind of if you want to coming to Ireland and want to stay for kind of five years or six years or more than two years and you want to settle kind of thing for a longer period of time, then try to uh, get a two years contract and, uh, and, 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 and uh, start your research in Ireland. So, uh, so that's what I wanted to quickly suggest in this video.